the chimpanzees of Happy Town. There was a town not far from here called Dradsville, USA, where all the houses looked the same and all of them were gray. There were no parks to play in, there were no trees at all, and the chimpanzees who lived there all felt very sad and small. Now Chutney was a traveler. He traveled far and wide, and he came home with a box one day that had a seed inside. He planted it and watered it and watched it slowly grow, until one day the mayor looked down and shouted, No, no, no! From way up in his palace he had spotted Chutney's seed, and now he bellowed, Chop it down! Destroy that nasty weed! You can't grow things in Drabsville, the mayor began to wail. Guards, seize that wretched chimpanzee and throw him into jail. So Chutney went to prison where his cell was cold and bare, and the mayor left for his winter break to catch some country air. But meanwhile, back at Chutney's house, the boy and girl next door said, We must water Chutney's seed and make it grow once more. And with the children's love and care, it wasn't very long before the seed stretched out its shoots and grew up tall and strong. And Chutney from his prison cell looked out one day to see the leaves and flowers and branches of his own beloved tree. It gave him strength, it gave him hope, it made him happy too. And when at last they let him out, he said, there's work to do. Chimpanzees, this town is dead. How lifeless it's become. Let's celebrate our differences. Let's make it bright and fun. Let's make our houses colorful. Let's pull our fences down. And while we're at it, why not change its name to Happy Town? Happy Town! The chimpanzees fell silent. These were stirring words to hear. He's right, they said. That chutney's right. And they began to cheer. I'm going to paint mine pink, one said. That's what I'm going to do. Then I'm going to climb up on the roof and paint the chimney blue. My windows will look fabulous without those iron bars, and the walls will be a symphony of flowers and hearts and stars. Then Chutney stopped and looked up at the palace of the mayor. The children need a place to play, he said. Let's build it there. So they pulled the palace down and built a playground with some swings, a carousel, a rocket ship, and lots of other things. Let's have a party, Chutney said, with yummy things to eat. There were sausages and ice creams, there was dancing in the street. And everyone was happy now, except of course the mayor, who came back to his palace, but his palace wasn't there. What's happened here, he cried. Enough! Guards seize them, everyone! But the guards, of course, just laughed and said, we're having much too fun. So they put him into prison where he settled in quite well until the new mayor came one day and opened up his cell. Mayor Chutney said, you see my tree? Well now I hope you know that everything that we cut down will find a way to grow. And things will always blossom if we dare to set them free. It's no different for a little flower than for a chimpanzee.